it does feel weird to be back. But in the last few weeks, I've learned a lot. And one of the biggest things I've learned is that I can't just crawl into a corner in the dark and disappear. I need to move forward. I made my personal life my job. I can't do that right now. I don't feel ready to do that right now, but my personality is still there and that's something I do want to share with you guys and hopefully you'll accept it. I knew that when I decided to come back to this channel, I didn't want anything to be the same. I wanted to try new things. You know, I used to always say, oh, I'm going to try this and I'm going to do that. And I'm going to make this type of content and I never did. So right now it's an opportunity to try something new. You know, I'm really lucky because I have some of the most amazing friends and I'm excited to have new experiences with them. Now that I'm back, I'm like, you know what? Let's try something new. Let's do something exciting. That sounds kind of stupid. Let's do that. Hey, you guys, do you want to go laser tag, playing laser tag tomorrow? Like around four-ish, possibly, depending on when Josh gets furniture. Let me check the calendar. Music has always been a big thing in my life. I have so many ideas that I want to share with you guys, so many things with music and new types of content, and I'm, I'm working on it already. Not the same chord progression. It could be. No, yeah. It should be like a whole different key. Yeah. Am I ready? I'm waiting on my life. It's time to take it to another level. <laughs> so to the next level, which is what? <laughs> what is the next level? Um... It is a little on the meaty side, isn't it? I have cheese and crackers too, so it'll... I'll be once you put the corn bread in there. So I went over to Erin and Adam's place and I'm here to help her edit her first YouTube video ever for her channel. But before we do that, we had a really cool fun night where we uh, we ate some chili with some friends. That's childhood right there. You're still like vomiting. I looked down my hand and fire ants were all over my hands. <laughs> Get me out of here. I really hate this. I'm never coming back. We had it parked so far away in that, that big dirt lot because it's down in Perry, Georgia. Yeah. Right now you have the full entire cut. Yeah. You got to add in sound graphics. While I was gone and not uploading anything, my little sister took over my channel for me and everyone loved her and I think it's like a no-brainer. She needed her own channel. So when my first video launched, we launched a channel for her. So right now we are editing her very first video. So I'm teaching her how to edit. I'm showing her just kind of the basics of how you put a YouTube video together. We've already shot all the footage. We're just doing all the stuff behind the scenes that most people don't see in the whole YouTube world, which is part of my favorite thing about YouTube is the editing process. You probably don't know about me. I think you should have text pop on the screen for that. What's your favorite thing so far? Because you shot so many videos without me here. Mm -hmm. How did it feel to kind of step onto a channel that already had so many subscribers to it? Mm, it was definitely exciting and fun and a little scary. Yeah. There's a lot of people watching. Yeah. <laughs> Um, but it just, yeah, it showed me, it's kind of like a trial run, like, do I really want to do this? And I'm like, yeah. So you do want to do this? Yeah. You want to be a YouTuber? Yes, please. Why do you want to be a YouTuber? Because I like entertaining people and mm -hmm. making people happy, and I like, um, the more I see the editing, the more I think I'm going to like that part, too. Yeah. Because I got sucked in pretty pretty fast just a little bit that I knew how one of the coolest parts about this whole thing is Aaron and I have made videos together since we were little kids <laughs> yes raise the roof Aaron YouTube didn't exist when we made videos together and then you know we both went to college and I kept making videos and then Aaron you know pursued something else but mm -hmm. I kind of roped her in and brought her back So 
So this is kind of like, it's just old school. It's what we used mm. to do. I mean, I always, whenever you would visit or I would see you, we'd, I'd always participate. I don't think Def Leppard actually meant to pour sugar on someone, though. Well, then what did they mean? Yeah. But now I'm like, I don't want to just do it every now and then. You want to do it full time? Yeah. I hope the future of what this channel and my life is going to be is something brand new every single week. To take risks, to be more creative. But don't get me wrong, I'm not gonna give up on all the stuff that you love, like tastings and challenges and all that fun stuff. I mean, that's gonna happen, but for now, it's time for something new. And I am so appreciative of you guys. I know you've been there for me. So again, like, just thank you. Thanks for being there. I don't wanna just survive. I wanna thrive. So, go on this journey with me. Be nice people, I love you, and au revoir.